you guys are in here. I'm doing opening for the draw now pay later for this legendary QQ9 Moonlight. Pretty cool skin. I definitely want the QQ9. This is like the second time, maybe, maybe a third time. I don't know. They've been like a draw now pay later type thing. But I'm pretty sure this one's different. Like it works different from the one I remember. Like I think there was one like maybe like a year ago for a bunch of epic skins. This one actually has a legendary in it, which is pretty cool. Which I did do a pull whenever this draw came out because I do have a bunch of the items already. So. I'm pretty sure I can't get those ones again, which is nice. It's duplicate protected because those are the crown items. So I don't know exactly how this works, but I mean, we'll figure it out. Obviously, by the name of it, you can draw 10 now or 5. See what the items you get are and then pay for it if you want, which is nice. I'm not sure why you would draw 5 over 10, though. Like, what, what, why wouldn't you just do all 10? I'm not sure. But we'll see how this works, though. Again, QQ9 Moonlight here, pretty cool skin. We also have... Manta Ray, Silver in Infiltrator, kind of whatever. I don't. I wouldn't mind getting it, of course. Peacekeeper, MK2, Moonglow. It's a it's an alright skin. I'm not too crazy about it. Is the emo can't even view it. Karambit, and there's a bunch of other like rare, uncommon stuff. That's probably what I'm going to end up be getting. I think every ten pulls you're guaranteed a epic or legendary, though. So at least a galley's one epic item. We'll do ten pulls. I don't even know how much it costs for 10 pulls. This one pulls 80. So I'm curious to see how much 10 pulls is. It says you can click on this like thing for more chances here. Spend one CP to get another chance. If it says draw five times to get it get one chance, or draw ten times to get a chance. So and you can log in for six days to get another chance. So there's one for free you can get at least. It's a very a strange setup, but let's draw 10 and see how it goes. We got two epic items in that. 720 car points for this? Damn, that was more expensive than I thought it was going to be. And that's a 10% discount. I guess it makes sense if one pull is 80, then 10 pulls would be 800. So I might, I'm guaranteed those. So can I just, let me, let me buy this. So just one card point. Let's draw 10 again. This is going to be different then, huh? Also, this one I get the Peacekeeper instead in the backpack. This one's a little bit more worth it, I think, for 720 card points. But can I keep buying one, or is it only... Oh, no, I can only buy one time. But if I do 10 pulls, I get two more chances. Maybe we just do 10 separate pulls then. Damn, is that a good idea, though? You know what, let's just do it, because I didn't get the Legendary, so. Oh, we got the character skin. So that was definitely worth it then. That's probably the second best thing in the draw. Okay, okay. So that means I should be getting... Maybe too many attempts. There we go. So we have two of these chance things now, so we can do two more pulls without actually spending. So this one gives me the Peacekeeper. Do not care about that. We'll do one more. That one, was that like the same? That's like basically the same thing. Let me see. Yeah, the same epic items. I think we're going to see our claw points here. I got the character skin, which is pretty lucky, I guess. See, interesting concept. Interesting, interesting. I guess it does help you save some claw points, I guess, if you know you don't have enough claw points to buy the whole draw. But interesting concept. Again, it's different from the first time they've done a dry now pay later type thing. So interesting. Let me know if you guys got in the comments below if you guys did pulls for this. Anyone get the QQ9? How did your pulls look? Did you even end up doing any pulls or did you just do the free chance thing? Let me know. What are your thoughts on this type of concept? Again, I remember they did one like a year ago for like a bunch of epic skins. I don't know if they did one after that. So this might be the second one they've ever done. I don't remember exactly, but what are your thoughts? Let me know. Thanks for watching. Peace.